Hey, we're here with Aaron Woodman from Microsoft in New York City, and behind us is the world's largest Windows phone. Is this running Mango, or? Well, I have to tell you, a lot of people are like, hey, we just want to know what the maximum size was. Right. Thought, okay, well, it's about 60 feet tall, a little over 20 feet wide. Okay. It's something like a, over a 1,000 pixels by 600 pixels. It's got a lot of density for a screen that so, size. Here's what I'm saying. That's a pretty low pencil. <laughs> Like, I mean, if I get up close to that, like if I'm reading a, a book, you know. <laughs> the good news is you can read your book about six blocks away. That's true. <laughs> a lot of the Windows Phone is really focused on people. And so one of the things we thought would be a fun stun is actually for live action people. And so we actually have right now Ben Rudolph up. Give us a wig! So if I, try, if I touch him <laughs> from here. Like look, see, you're making him animate. This is the control room. Back here, actually, you can see a lot of people actually doing some of the screens that drive the live tiles. It's about 110 people that have been here for about four days. Just like in a, inside of a real Windows phone. So what I want to know is where where is the SIM slot? This is actually where we're going to control all of the individual tiles and actually start to kind of coordinate some of the live action scenes that you'll see throughout the actual day. There's two different stages in the actual phone that'll actually open up and really have live people doing a variety of pretty interesting stunts right. and that. I'm sure it's very, it's going to be wonderful. It's very animated. It's going to be very exciting. <laughs> That's right. uh, okay. Why don't we head upstairs, actually? So this is actually the, the top stage. This is an 8x8 panel, essentially, and it's got all of these uh, displays, and you can see that you can actually see some of the lights actually firing. Oh, yeah, firing. you can see them flapping. Right. Uh, and so essentially, these are actually driving the live tiles that people will see, and then we actually move them out of the way, like a large uh, garage door, yeah. uh, where you can actually see the live action. Then. How much did you drop on this? How, how much did it cost? It's about the price of a Windows phone. It's luckily subsidized <laughs> by your mobile operator. Okay. <laughs> no. Uh, no, but it's actually been a, it's, it's a pretty significant investment. I think more than right. anything, it shows kind of the idea that we want to create some stunts and some get people excited about the phone and the law. Do you think it's working? Yeah, you know, we, we see, I was here last night around 10 o'clock, and the number of people that were stopping, trying to figure out what it was, yeah. understand what was going on. Yeah, I think people are starting to take notice, and it's a good opportunity to just really say, like, hey. Microsoft makes really here. big we phones. We make huge phones. <laughs> so thank you so much for the tour. I'm going to slowly back away uh, from, from the, the, the live tile. <laughs> yeah, from the edge, basically. And, uh, you know, maybe I'm going to, I'll spend some time with some smaller phones. Maybe I'll build up to five inches, <laughs> you know, eventually. <laughs> I, I think this is too big for me, personally. I, I can imagine a lot of people feel that way. But thank you so much. Absolutely. I'm Paul Miller, and I'm a live tile, and I belong here. I was born in this city. I was born to make phone calls and express myself. Not really. I was actually born in Springfield, Missouri, near where Jason Bourne is from.